Oh, I have the perfect outing idea for you today. Let's get into it. Someone who has a very busy schedule but want to make time to spend with your loved one, then I have the perfect idea for you. This is a little something that I like to call a daycation because it's not quite a staycation because we don't stay overnight, but we like to do this, my husband and I, during the time when our children are at school. So if you're interested in seeing a great idea that you two can incorporate it, then just stay tuned. We are booking at the Zaza Spa and Hotel in Houston, dolls. Absolutely love this hotel. It is gorgeous. It's in the downtown area, so it is central. If you book a package with them at their spa, you have access to all of the other amenities, which I love. A daycation because we were just there. We got a couple's massage, so we just brought our clothing and things that we needed to Go ahead and change as we enjoy the spa and the amenities itself. So this is the locker room. Very nice, very demure. You get the, the robe, you get your loungewear, and that's all provided and included, or you can bring your own. I love the way that the decor is set up inside of the locker room. It's very elegant, very elevated. And so here I'm just in the locker room, just getting into my robe, getting changed and getting ready for the couple's massage. So just giving you dolls a quick overview. This is what the room looks like. This is me dolls, hi. And I'm just super excited to be spending some quality time with my man girl, okay? So once we exit, the locker room, it's really quiet, a very nice lighting outside of the locker room. This is inside, so you've got your steam room, you've got a sauna, you've got showers, changing areas, uh, places to shower and all of that. Once you come out of the room, it's a really nice, inviting, relaxing setting. There were other people present, so I didn't show you dolls around. But here's Mr. Fuller chilling, getting ready for our couple's massage. He ordered us some champagne. Champagne me please, yes. So we sat for a bit, we chatted. Uh, the lighting and such was just very romantic, very inviting. So absolutely love this and encourage you dolls to set something up as well, either here or wherever. So we went and did our couple's massage and after we came back, we sat some more in this little area. We ordered some more champagne and just chatted a bit. It was very intimate. Um, it was very quiet. There were other people here, of course. It's not just us, but it was really, really nice. So girls, from here, we decided that we were gonna go into the spa, well, into the sauna for just a bit, just to kinda get into that vibe, detox, and then we were gonna meet back out to go to the pool. So what I loved about this was that the pool is not a cold plunge pool, but it's a nice pool. So. We chatted for a little bit. Um, I went back into the locker room, which has a built-in infrared sauna. I did go ahead and take advantage of the cucumbers and the water and all of the things that they had set out in the locker room, which I thought was a nice touch. So here, I'm just grabbing some cucumbers. They had some cool towels or ice towels if you wanted to put that on your forehead as you're lounging in the sauna. No one was in the sauna, which was great. We were just gonna go in for 10 minutes and then meet up, change into our swimwear and go out by the pool. So here I am, girl, just indulging and living my best life. So I did uh, take a few moments just to unwind and to chill in the sauna and relax after we had that fantastic massage. Went into the locker room. I did pack my bag. I brought my Saint Laurent bag this time and also I brought my swim swimwear. So inside of my bag that I packed, I did have all of the necessities for by the pool since we planned to go to the pool. So I had brought a book, I brought my slides or sandals to put on by the pool, um, but you can very well just have worn the shoes that were provided. This is one that I'm reading, it's a suspense book. Uh, by Ruth Ware, which is another fantastic author. If you're looking to get into some books that are gonna keep your attention from the start to the finish, then I highly recommend Ruth Ware. But I brought my swimwear, this is from Amazon. Nothing too, um, too exciting, but I really do love the versatility of the one piece and I brought just some sunglasses for lounging, my blaze sunglasses. Quick fit check, mirror check, and we're off to the pool. So we met up, my husband and I, we met out. The pool is gorgeous, you dogs. It's on the second floor of the Zaza in Houston. And like I was saying, this is the one 
that is closest to downtown in Houston, but they do have another location. But prefer this one because the pool is really nice here and it's very quaint. So we just set out. It was a little early to order cocktails and food, um, which started around 11.30 or 12. And this was an early day for us. So whenever we do the daycations, we do them early. We drop the kids off at school, in this case, for this day. And we headed over downtown to just hang out, you know, just to have some time together. We got the massage, like I said, and then we chilled by the pool for a while. Um, I did get in the pool. It was super cold, even though it was a hot day. The water was cold. It was like a cold plunge, but I enjoyed that. So that was nice. And then next on the agenda, we wanted to order some food. Got the menus out. The drinks were really cute. And so we ordered some drinks. My husband ordered some food. He got breakfast tacos. I forgot what I got, but I know that it was good it was like a drink mixed with champagne and um it had a cute little flower on the inside of it so very nice um reasonably priced but uh worth the money the weather was gorgeous it was early so there was a nice breeze as well and everybody was very nice i ended up getting the lox and bagels which is one of my absolute favorites and i got so much food it was um very very good though it came with capers salmon um, you know, bagel toasted and all of that. So it was still like a brunch morning type vibes. It was very early that we were there, but we like to get there super early so that we can actually enjoy our time. Because in this case, we do have a lot of activities our children do. We have a lot of activities with our kids. So after we left from here, we actually headed straight to do car rider pickup. And um, our sons had some events afterwards, like games and trainings and such. So this was just a great time to wind down, to reconnect, and to spend some quality time together. So a daycation, by definition, I don't even know if it's really a thing. I know a staycation is a thing, but you stay overnight. But for us, we do the daycations where you just go, you spend some time together during the day. So I really like to do this at the spas and such because you can you know, get some services done. You could do the um, massages like we did, or you could do like, you know, other groomings or different things, but you get some spa treatments. And then you also just have some time to wind down and relax, talk one-on-one -on -one, um, and just, you know, enjoy yourself. So I highly recommend booking something like this. It doesn't have to be at this location, but this is just to give you an idea and to get your creative juices flowing. This is my first time at the Zaza. I really enjoy this location. It's just so serene. Everyone is so nice. The service is always top tier. And the amenities and the features of the hotel are just beautiful. So I've been here several times, you know, for different things, um, staycations of my own. I had my, um, shower here after i had my babies i you know used to have little staycations and stuff here so i'm very familiar gotten pedicures manicures they do offer a full line of services so if you're in houston then definitely check it out so we just went back inside after this stalls we changed um we went through the spa like i said it's just a really nice spa very elevated and um, just very upscale which i like so we got some water they have water infused as you're coming back into the spa they have little you know light bites and stuff on the other side but this is the sitting area where you would wait for your services and it's just a really nice experience so we went back in we got changed and we headed outside to go on about our day but the good thing is is that we've already spent some time together as we were heading into the weekend and we didn't have to worry about trying to cram something in along with you know having the kids and different activities during the weekend this was perfect for us on a friday and yes really really enjoyed it again this is the hotel zaza this is a spa but it is also um, a place if you wanted to do a staycation you could definitely book a room stay overnight the aesthetic of the hotel is gorgeous it's perfect for dining out if you wanted to stay here go to dinner afterwards or you know host an event host a little private dinner that sort of thing they also have a really nice happy hour if i'm not mistaken on the weekends um and also you know happy hours in the evenings that you can partake in and come check out the hotel for yourself
So that brings us to the end of this video, dolls. It was short and sweet, but I wanted to just share with you guys something that I absolutely love to do and give you some ideas if you want to pick up something to do or have a new idea for something to do in your area or if you're local, of course, you can book the Zaza. But this is just a really cute idea that I wanted to share with you. Again, I'm calling it a daycation, a little bit less than a staycation, but just as effective as well. So we just headed out um, to the car. If you've ever been around Houston and you've seen the uh, Zaza um, cars, then they have the big long horns on the front of the cars and you can absolutely get shuttle service, you know, to go locally while you're staying at the hotel. They will pick you up, drop you off, and it's right in the museum district, so you could definitely go in to the museum, which I believe was like really close, um, almost walking distance, or you could get shuttled there. But anyways, dolls, that is the end of this video. I hope that you dolls enjoyed it. Are you thinking of doing a daycation now that you've seen this video? If so, be sure to comment below and let me know what you thought about this. Have you stayed at the Zaza? Did you like it? Would you try this idea out? But we're heading out, dolls, so be sure to like, comment, and if you haven't already, be sure to subscribe, dolls, and I will see you in the next one. Bye. Okay, so on that runway, no